Oh look, Beato's got a new video out. Hey everybody, I'm Rick Beato. Check out this song. Shit. Hey everyone, for the millions of you who watched our last video, you know we had something special planned. We're going to do the first cover on the channel. We're going to do Just a Beaver's song, Anyone, which is a smash hit, just as a way to kind of show you what our band was capable of, what we love doing, taking mm -hmm. pop songs, made them rock and roll. Then what happened? Tell them what happened. Then the, the unthinkable happened. Internet bad boy and everybody's favorite DILF, Rick Beato, bent us over his subscribe button and f***ed us. D and Y. Just for reference, uh, here's the total version. And here's our version. So you can see the problem there. Yeah. There, there are some similarities. We didn't want to get caught up in this drama. It's not <clears> our place. <throat> We're new to the game, you know. We didn't want this. We didn't want this. This is real. This is actually happening to us right now. You know, there's beef now between Beaver and Beato, and we're just wrapped up in it. Yeah. And so people have been asking us, you know, Twitter's blowing up. <clears throat> you guys have to talk about it, right? And, you know, it's hard. It's hard to say, do you do you engage with the trolls like Beato, right? Yeah. Do, you, do you give him the time of day? Or is it just better to ignore him? Yeah. But we just thought we had to say something. This is us saying something. Y'all know we worked really hard on trying to get this cover going. We recorded it, did several different takes over several different days, spent a lot of time, edited it, mixed it, mastered it, the whole works. We had it ready to be pushed, you know, out to live. And then we had a snowstorm. This morning, the humanitarian crisis in Texas is accelerating. Millions still without power or water. Well, in that time, Rick Beato f***ed us. D and Y. And that's how we got where we are. In the middle of this drama, wrapped up between Beato, Steve, just Beaver, and now us. We didn't want to be here. Um, but we have to say something. Yeah. You know, small creators, we have to say something. Right. You have to stand up for yourself. And when you're a small creator starting out <clears throat> on YouTube and these platforms, these big guys like yeah. Beato will just push you around. Yeah. Um, I don't think it's asking too much for an apology from Beato and Beaver at this point. It would mean a lot just to our fans. You yeah. know, they did nothing wrong. So where does that leave us today? Obviously, we're not going to put out that video. Um, wouldn't be right. It wouldn't be right. We want to be respectful. Um, but, you know, we've got more things coming. We can't just let this keep us down. You know, at some point, we're going to have to move forward with our lives, with our, our, our YouTube video, our, our fans. Um, our fan base. That's one thing I, I'd say is, you know, don't go after Rick or Justa. Yeah. You know, like, they're good guys, probably. Um, we don't know them personally, mm -hmm. you know. Mm -hmm. But this is just, this is the internet, you know. This yeah. just, it happens. So don't, you know, we love that people try and, you know, protect creators that you love. We yeah. have a great fan base. But let's just not go after them, you know. Let's be better than that. <clears throat> yeah. Let's Let's set good examples for people like Rick to follow. Yeah. Um, rise above. Let's rise above. You know, the worst part about it is we're both subscribers of Rick Beato. Yeah. yeah. We love him. Yeah. Um, I think we just want to make him proud. We want to make him proud. Yeah. Maybe maybe the next cover we do or next video we'll do, he'll, he'll, he'll respect it, you know, finally. Yeah.